Hi, I'm Dr. Robert Berry. Let's talk a little bit about cataracts. Now you have to learn a little anatomy. This is an eye model. In your eye you have the cornea in the front, a watery space. The pupil and the iris are the light regulating mechanism that lets light from out here go into the eye through the lens of the eye. And the lens of the eye is clear protein surrounded by a very thin little capsule. It focuses the light to the retina in the back of the eye that's like the film in a camera. It picks up the sensation of light and sends it to the brain. You make sense out of it as vision in the brain. In kids, the lens is absolutely perfectly clear, like glass under water. In adults, it always has a little bit of a tinge to it. And if it's really got a lot of color and fogginess, that's a cataract. Here's an example of a cataract. Okay, standard cataract, yellow-brown, and it's physically harder than the normal natural lens. Think of it like an egg with an egg white. When you, when you put it in a frying pan, the white of the egg is clear. And as soon as the heat hits that protein, it turns it white. It's the same protein, but you've altered the structure with heat. In people, over the years, the structure of the protein is altered and it's no longer transparent. Now it gets foggy and hazy and you can't see out. The doctor can't see in to check the condition of the eye. Cataract surgery removes the lens of the eye. And I want to make the point that it's always elective. It's never a rush. You can live with a cataract. It doesn't hurt the eye. It doesn't hurt your body. You just can't see through it. It blocks the vision, but it doesn't damage it. And when you fix the cataract, you should get your vision back. The timing of the surgery is truly elective. You figure out when it's time to do it based on how much trouble you're having doing those everyday things that we all do. Read, drive, especially against headlights at night, trying to see small print, see the trailers on the TV at night, going across the news, trying to see your golf ball on the fairway. When you can't do those things and you're having to make adjustments in your lifestyle, then it's time to think about surgery. When you take a cataract out, you've removed some of the lens focusing power of the eye and you replace it with a man-made lens. Man-made lenses are smaller than the natural lens, but you put them in the same place and they literally kind of rattle around for a bit before the capsule bag shrink wraps around it and holds it firmly. And then it should be set for life. But the point to make here is cataracts are very common. Everybody gets cataracts. You want to live long enough to get a cataract. Statistically, 75% of people 70 or older have cataract. Now that's a fogging of the lens. Everyone gets that haze, that little color change. The timing of surgery is elective. You can live with it a long time. You only go after it when you're having enough trouble with your daily activities to warrant the risk of surgery.